Hi, and welcome to your Desperate Office Setup training video. Here we are going to talk about self-serving floor plans, but also advanced check-in options, expanding to other resources such as parking, and your office settings. As you can see, we are already in Desperate app, and we are in the admin section, which is only visible to admin people, which are global admins, office admins, and managers. You do have on the left your office configuration, but also the booking settings and parking ones. Let's start with the basic data. You do have here the name and address of your office. And by scrolling down, you can see the opening hours, but also the access type for it. Is it a shared office, so everyone can use it? Or is it a restricted one, basically to a user group, for, for example? Next, we have the floors and spaces. This is where you can actually put your floor plan into Deskbird. By clicking on add floor, it will add an, another floor here. Then you just have to open it here and add an area. I've created one beforehand with an onboarding video area with a capacity of five desks. If I click on details here, I can have the ability to restrict the access or give it a priority access to specific users. For now, let's leave it as open access. I have all my desks here with the access. Is desk one a shared access or is it restricted to a specific users? I can put it here. If I click this tick box, I will allow others to book this space if the assigned user is not in the office. So now, if I go back and I want to edit the floor plan, I prepared one that I've already put in the environment. You can use a SVG format, a JPEG format, or a PNG format. We have our, our, our area that we have placed beforehand here and within we can place our resources desk one desk two desk three desk four and desk five i save and voila your floor plans are done how easy it was Last but not least, if I go back here, I have the ability to download QR code for the floor that I just created, but I can also create it for the entire area or at the desk level. By doing so, I will generate a QR code for users to check in when they arrive at their desk. This is very handy as well to mention to the system that the user is actually sitting physically at his desk and allows also everyone to know that this person is really at the office. If you feel that QR codes are something that is of your interest, please do not hesitate to contact us at support at desperate.com. Let's go next. We do have the desks, parking and others section here with the booking settings. Here, you have the ability to put how many days in advance can users book. Global administrators, office administrators, managers, group managers and users. You also have the check-in options here and we have our QR code there. If you enable the check-in with QR code, then people will be able to scan with their mobile phone the the QR code and check in directly from there. And finally, equipment section. This is where you can add any equipment that your desk has or your office has, such as two monitors, curve monitor, EV charger for the parking spot, standing desk, anything that you think might be relevant to have within Desperate app. Guys, that's it for our Office Setup video. I think you are good to go now. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.